Explore Fantasia's like, explore some more crazy shit. A mushroom shaped tumor growing in my eyeball. For real? You know, I've been doing a lot of research on choroidal melanoma. Is cancer really a fungus? Oh, okay, let's check it out. Here's what my eye, my good eye looks like. My right eye. It's all clear, roundy inside. Okay, and then this is what my left eye looks like. Bam, baby. We got mushroom. I wouldn't have believed it if they hadn't showed me pictures. I've only known since September 7th, 2023. I did get the Moderna vaccine so I could go to Ghana and be with my family friends when they got married. But this is not a vaccine related case. Uh, for the last two years, I have not eaten eggs, any sort of dairy, nothing aged, like grapes that turn into raisins that turn into wine, no alcohol, no wheat, rye, oats, grain, corn, sodium metabisulfate, anything that's canned goods, like pickles and vegetables that are canned goods, those preservatives I'm sensitive to. Oh, and I have cleared up my breathing and I, I feel like my lungs have healed themselves. I quit smoking on April 15th, found a dispensary that was providing flower cannabis that had umulene as a terpene. And umulene is good for anti-inflammatory, anti-tumor, anti, -tumor, anti uh, munchies so it was a perfect cocktail for me for the last three months my regimen had changed so I wasn't able to continue the cannabis and um, the eating habit because we were traveling on this epic journey across the Americas so pretty much I have lived on bananas and cashews for the last two years and then I find out that uh, aflofloxin B1 is a fungus that grows on grain and peanuts and nuts um, that is not sensitive to heat so you can cook it and you're still digesting this aflofloxin B1 fungus and um, we're not addressing that fungus could potentially be cancer. So give me three months. Give me three months to shrink it. I'm looking for know about this kind of tumor and are familiar with the body's potential for healing instead of just cutting things out. It's not a tumor. So I was trying to reach out to Dr. Timothy Brantley um, who wrote a really cool book. I met him a couple years ago and he encouraged me to stop smoking. Thanks so much. Um, but also um, there's some other um, doctors that are in the know about um, and uh, resonate more with me about this cancer thing. Let's get a bionic and eye and um, be a part of some cool science and um, experiment and, and make the world a better place. If you have any tips or ideas, send me a message. If you want to send me some love, send me a message. I'd love to hear from you.